goodness unlimited, a place of beauty uncharted, joy unbounded, blessings freely granted, fun and fulfillment, living in the moment, you and all meet each other, caring for one another. I am Raghad Lathebi and I am Nova Lisa. We made this video as a part of a class activity for international business at Princess Noura University. In this video, we will talk about Indian culture and general information about it. India is a country in South Asia, which represents 17.7% .7 of the world total population. Their culture has a thousand of unique subculture of all religion and communities. Their language, religion, and food is different from place to place within 29 states. In general, their popular religions is Hinduism, Islam, and Buddhism, and the mostly spoken language is Hindi. India is considered as one of the BRIC countries which believe to be the future dominant supplier of manufactured goods and services as well as China. By 2050, they will be wealthier than the current world economic power. Now, let's start our journey to discover Indian culture through interviews with Indian people. First question, what does India mean to you? It's everything for me, okay? It's my mm -hmm. birth. It's a beautiful country. The people are very nice over there. India and this is Saudi is a different culture and different peoples and different everything this is different. How can you describe Indian culture? It's a multicultural place. Many uh, people belonging to different religion, they are coming together and they are staying together. The culture are so tight in India that we cannot uh, judge from the person's personality. What we follow, the same Saudi Arabia people also follows the same traditions. They go by their tradition, like if we are Hinduism, we follow our religion, they also do the same. Have you ever felt confused by the action of someone from other culture? Not exactly confused, but yeah, surprised because uh, every culture have their own standards, every culture has their own um, view of point. Like uh, we Indian people uh, come up uh, with uh, brides in red colors, but when I came to Saudi, uh, here the brides are dressed up in white. Mm -hmm. So it was a little surprising for me. Did you work in India before? Yes. How can you describe your relationship with your co-workers in India? They were very friendly in the relationship with me. Till now my co-workers uh, and I have a very healthy and friendly relationship. Is there any difference between Indian and Saudi culture? Actually, yes, the, there is a difference between both the cultures. But both the cultures having their own separate beautiful norms and views. Mm -hmm. So I cannot compare the cultures which is good and which is bad. Uh, do you think there is similarities between them? Yes, similarities there. Like uh, here, I have seen the culture that you give importance in Saudi uh, to at humanitarian grounds. You are very caring. You are loving. The working environment definitely has changed. Here we collaborate. Now we got to know about the Bangladesh peoples. We got to know about the Saudi peoples. We work with the Filipino. We are getting a little bit knowledge about the other countries as well. Before we are not Indian peoples very hard worker. My assistant, one of Saudi, his name is Khalid. Nice man, nice attitude. Problem, what happened, you know, this lazy. What do you like about Saudi culture? Saudi culture, I love the people of Saudi. The humanity, this is the one of the best thing over here. If you talk with the Saudi people, they're very emotional. They are like, if you give politely, they will cut your neck also and give it to you. Same thing like that. No, I am 27 years. I like too much in Saudi Arabia. Right, because you know, Saudis uh, uh, people are okay. In good. your opinion, which culture is more uh, collaborative? I think so, both the cultures. Over here, also, I see collaborations. I never see that uh, anybody in Saudi you are not uh, welcoming 
everybody so beautifully welcoming similarly in india they also welcoming because in india we see n number of foreigners who are coming in india and they are taking classes when a person comes from outside so the the person teaches you something different from their practical knowledge right mm-hmm. so it's a perfectly a welcoming everywhere in india right. why is because in india we celebrate each and every festival together in our country hindu muslim sikh isai every people celebrate their different different uh, festival with together can you know, people okay good culture good attitude better than very nice people don't want to make problem anything but this only problem this is this do you see indian people as a high or low risk taker they are high risk taker people we from childhood it's uh, inside us that uh, we will love challenges challenges bring risk and it's not specifically in india i even see it in in saudi arabia what country do you think that have more diversity in cultures definitely it's in india because in india there are uh, n number of uh, people who belongs to different cultures and they are looking uh, living staying together like uh, christians are there hindus are there so many like muslims are there we celebrate each and every festival together with the Mm, but why do we have to understand or learn other cultures? Understanding other cultures help us as individuals to interact with other nationalities better and avoid misunderstanding. It helps us better understand different values, attitudes and beliefs with better engagement with the world around us or even at diverse work for companies it helps gain a competitive advantage. Additionally, encourage the diversity in the workplace, help the company have different skills knowledge areas and expertise which utilize maximum benefit and increase the productivity as we understand from dr naila saval saraj and shravan indian culture has many similarities with saudi arabian culture so both countries can easily communicate with each other in terms of hosted dimensions they tend more of future visionary and higher risk taking behavior unlike saudi arabia and the end we hope our video was informative and entertaining for you we will post our behind the scene video you will find the link in the description box please feel free to put your suggestions or recommendation in the comments below and now we will leave you with the national anthem of india jana gana mana adinayak jay ho bharat bhagya vidata panchab sindh puja rat varata तब सुबह नामे जागे तब सुबह आशीष मागे राय जब जय गाता जन गन मन की जय भारत भाग्य विधाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय हे जय हे